Continuing from my previous video about Far Harbour, we're now actually going to Far Harbour. And of course, there's a few things that we have to get straight uh, when we get there, because um, the first thing we'll have to do is defend it, whichever the island sends. So I want to do that flawless, I do not want any deaths. So that would be one thing I'll be thinking about. I'm going to do a weapon check in a minute, make sure I've got everything I need. So the island in Far Harbour is in permanent darkness practically, you'd rarely see a sunrise here, so uh, it's all shadows and stuff, you're going to need a light, a bright light, I've just got a standard light at the moment, but I might well upgrade it to a bright light. And so yes, we're going to defend Far Harbour, um, let's do the introduction. Put the damn gun down. Are you lost? This is Far Harbor. We, uh, we don't get many visitors around here. We don't need no freeloaders or more help, Mainlander. So you can get back in your boat and leave. Alan, this isn't your dock. It belongs to the whole town. And that means strangers are welcome. Uh, sorry, you've caught us during a, a difficult time. Uh, but Alan's got a point. Not all visitors have good intentions. So, uh, what's your business here? A young woman from the Commonwealth named Kasumi may have passed through here. Her family hired me to find her. Some sort of detective, huh? Well, she came through here all right. At least we know she made it this far. Damn it. Mariners ain't coming. Something's coming through the fog! You, help us defend the town and I'll answer any questions you have. Take a post at the top of the wall near the main gate. The hall never lets us down. Now follow me! Okay, so it's up the stairs and to the left. Uh, sometimes Captain Avery doesn't follow you up the stairs, but if you go up the stairs, it w they will follow you eventually. Right, it's co they're coming now. I'll be using small arms until I'm sure that the survivors are in, and then it'll be like the heavy guns. Okay, look, I'm at level, I'm over 100 level now, so I don't know what level these guys are going to be. Let's see how it plays out. A little bit of music. What the hell? I've got wounded out here. There's no time. Look to the fog. They're coming. Gulpers! Defend yourselves! Hunters! Look out! What the? It's over. No. Eyes on the fall. Something's coming. Anglers! Clear. Well done, all. Well, that's the battle over with. Guys are very uh, low level, as, as far as I can tell. The last time I was here, there were some bigger ones than this out there. Ooh, that's very nice. So that will complement my armor, my uh, charisma armor setup. I'll have one for every limb. Okay, so I'll just clean up here and head back and talk to Avery and advance the quest to the next level. Excellent. No deaths, as far as I can tell. Alan? Huh. The mainlander. Great. Fire your gun a few times and you think you're some sort of hero? This is our fight. Our island. Not yours. I 
am the one who saved all your asses. So yeah. We've defended this damn dock from crabs and worse for months without you. Yeah, you helped. But we've paid our dues in blood and bullets. The day we rely on outsiders for our security is the day we're as good as dead. I guess you have a point. Damn straight. So if you're here to buy some ordnance, do your business. Otherwise, take the first boat out of here. Before the children of Adam or worse get you. Show me what you got. Let's deal. Okay, so yeah, I do want Alan on my side. I, he can be a bit of a, a rough customer, but uh, yeah, I'll get him on my side. He's got some good kit. Uh, I don't go for the harpoons myself, but I do like the clothing. Okay, so I'll do a bit of shopping and then we'll carry on. Avery. And now you see what we're up against. The fog and the creatures it spits out have taken the whole island from my people. But for your help when we needed it, you deserve this. What's the fog? Where to begin? The fog's radioactive, right? But there are pockets of it, the deep fog, that are hard fallout. And as deadly as that is, that's only part of the problem. Things live in the fog, thrive. You think what attacked the harbor's bad? Oh, there's far worse further inland. You've lost the whole island? Oh, the fog's been here forever. There are good years when it recedes and the island's almost normal. Then there are times when it spreads all over. And people have to cling to any patch of land free of the fog. For the past, oh, eight years or so, it's been getting as bad as it's ever been. Now, Far Harbor's one of the only places left that's safe. If you manage to survive despite all that, you must be tough. <laughs> Ornery, more like. I just... I'm done cowering behind your damn hull, Avery. Time you let me deal with the real problem. With the right people and my guns, I can end those children of Adam cultists for good. The fog's been here forever. The children didn't make it. Before the rat eaters came, the fog was under control. They come, and it all goes wrong. It's time we do something. No need to burden the stranger with all this nonsense. Sounds like you should deal with the children of Adam. Permanently. I'm not sure that's going to make our job here easier. Of course, Nick's alluded to the fact that Dima's going to want us to infiltrate the children of Adam and replace their leader, and so taking them out is not part of the plan, so that's why Nick said that. But of course, he's never actually had a conversation with Dima as yet, not on his own as far as I know. So that's just the game forecasting what's happening next. The mainlander sees the sense in all this. I will do everything in my power to keep the peace here. So go, Alan. Sorry for all that. You're here for Kasumi, right? She headed inland to the Synth Refuge, Acadia. Getting there will be dangerous. You'll need a guide. Old Longfellow. No one knows the fog like him. But a uh, word of warning, he's a bit of an acquired taste. What can you tell me about Acadia? Ask Longfellow. He's the only one that's been there. Thanks for the info. <laughs> Best place to look for Longfellow's at the bar. The last plank. And, uh, please, lend a hand around town if you're able. Even if it's slapped away, 
People like the Mariner and Cassie and others need help. And let me say something you might not hear again. Thank you.